Have you ever seen a more bootleg faucet than this? Vice grips for handles? We gotta get this thing out of here. As always, the first step is to shut the water off to the faucet. Clear the pipe for cutting. Bring in your Milwaukee Auto Cutters and cut it out. Throw this right in the scrap bin. And now, just so I don't offend anybody in the comments, I'm gonna deburr the pipe. Normally, I wouldn't clean the pipe like this, but it had a little bit of paint on the backside I had to get off. Quick little dusting. Now let's prep the faucet. Thread on these little union female adapters. Now thread in the little set screw. Now place the faucet on the sink where you want it. Snug up the set screw and tighten it down with some channel locks. Now make sure that the faucet is secured to the sink. Male adapters, pipe dope, thread tape. Let's go. Three wraps around each thread should be fine. Slap a little bit of that pipe dope on there. Make sure it's a good amount of pipe dope. We don't want to have any leaks. Now insert the male adapters into the female adapters on the faucet. Snug up both unions with a big crescent wrench. Then tighten down both male adapters. Ahoy, I see land! Oh, wait, never mind. That's just the pipe going into the male adapter. We are almost done. Let's add a couple of couplings. Now let's add some lines to make sure that we are at the correct depth. Loosen up the unions, attach to your existing pipe, and crimp your joints. Now let's repeat that on the cold side. Make sure that your unions are nice and snug. Perfect. Now let's turn the water on and test it out. This faucet came out great. Nice job.